Hello, my name's Nick Picard and I play Tony in Television's Hollyoaks and as you know we're 18 this year so I thought I'd get my old scrapbook out and have a look at some of the old cast pictures. Okay, first picture here is of the very first ever speaking scene in Hollyoaks which I was lucky enough to be in and funny enough I still remember all the dialogue from it which I won't go into but that was with me and Jeremy Edwards who played Kurt. Gosh, look at that haircut. It's changed a lot now, hasn't it? No hair at all. This is the first ever cast of Hollyoaks. There was seven of us, four girls and three boys. I was 19 when I started filming and it was 20 by the time we come to air so I've, I'm actually 38 now so hence 18 years. Not a lot of people know this, I've lived with Jimmy McKenna for 18 years as well. Jimmy who plays Jack, um, he rents a room off me in my house and so we've been, I mean that's a, a, a lifelong friendship that I've had with him. So we've sort of all grown up in each other's pockets which is, um, which is a lovely thing about this job that I love. Well as you know Tony's had lots of ladies, yep we've got the old lovely Sarah Dunn there. Jackie uh, played by Claire Cooper. Julie Buckfield, who played Julie as well. Elise de Toy, who played Izzy. <laughs> God, there's loads, isn't there? Um, Steph Waring, who played Cindy Cunningham. But hopefully now he's found happiness with Diane. Let's hope so. Oh, it was the best kiss, so I shouldn't answer questions like that, should I really? They were all lovely kisses. I wouldn't say there are any par parallels between Nick and Tony. I mean, I'm 38, I'm still not married, so maybe I've had a lot of, lot of girlfriends as well, but um, I think that's the only sort of comparison. I think the standout moments for me over the 18 years are normally always when you go away. Um, the first one ever was when I went away with Kurt Jambo and uh, Baz FM. I don't know if anyone remembers Baz FM, played by Toby Sawyer. Um, we went to Ibiza. When you go away, you don't just go away with your mates, well, the cast. You go away with all the crew, it's about 50 odd people. So it's sort of like a big boys and girls go away on, on tour sort of thing. So, um, so you have a lot of fun. The stories that have meant the most to me, I mean, obviously a lot of my stuff was with Sarah Dunn when we did it. Um, obviously, uh, with my daughter dying, Baby Grace, that was a really challenging storyline. And I think we did a good job on screen. I've also enjoyed, obviously, the stuff I've been doing recently with the uh, Tony having cancer. Um, it's really, you know, put me through the paces again, which are sometimes you forget you, you're doing, you know, because it's so much fun working here. Yeah, I'm hoping that Tony's finally met the love of his life in Diane, and maybe there'll be a little wedding along the line. Maybe, we never know, because he's married a few. Maybe he's just taking it nice and easy. Um, I mean, he has proposed, so maybe this is the start of Tony's settling down. Just like to say, I love this show. I've met a lot of lovely people along the way, and roll on the next 18 years. Happy birthday, Hollyoaks. <laughs>